This car was one of the first pickups that were officially delivered to the Russian market. And today there are a lot of them on the secondary. How profitable is this Japanese in operation? Currently, the demand for pickup trucks is higher than ever. In addition to people who, by the nature of their activities, need just such a car, these are huntsmen, geologists, and oil workers. The number of those who simply like pickups is growing. One of these cars is the Mazda B2500. It is unpretentious, simple, and reliable, not afraid of off-road and is capable of transporting not only people, but also quite heavy loads. The pickups are based on a powerful frame on which rests a four-door body with a double cab for five seats, others were not supplied to us. There is only one engine, a 2.5-liter turbo diesel, 109 horsepower. The box is also the same, a five-speed manual. All-wheel drive transmission of the part-time type without center differential, 4 times 4 mode can only be used off-road, with a rigidly connected front axle and a reduction gear. Suspension, continuous rear axle on springs, and in front, independent torsion bar. In principle, special comfort is not expected from machines of this type, but the interior of the pickup truck looks car-like. In fact, it looks a lot like the interiors of some Ford models, in particular the Mondeo, which was produced in the mid-90s. And this is not surprising because the Mazda B2500 is practically a twin of the Ford Ranger. At least inside the pickup it is quite cozy, and the driver and front passenger are provided with light comfort. Behind the wheel, you can get comfortable, although the seat height adjustment is not provided. They save decent ranges of movement of the steering column up and down, standard pickup equipment. True, the transmission control levers are inconveniently located. The gear lever is placed to the right of the transfer case handle, and you have to reach for it. Because of this, when you turn on, say, the fifth gear, a person of short stature experiences certain difficulties. A strange technical solution, after all, the owner does not use the demultiplier so often, and the gearbox handle should always be at hand. Only two will be comfortable on the back sofa, however, landing on the second row of seats is quite comfortable. The optimal backrest angle contributes to the correct landing, so that the rear passengers do not get tired on a long journey. True. Tall riders will have to almost rest their knees on their own chin. Pickup trucks are a priori presented by manufacturers as workhorses, indispensable helpers at construction sites and agricultural land, faithful companions of hunters and fishermen. Apparently, to make life easier for the owners, these machines are equipped quite generously. For example, in the basic version of the Mazda B series, brought from Europe, frontal airbags, power steering, power windows for all doors, heated mirror servos, central locking and a head unit were met. More expensive versions were equipped with air conditioning and alloy wheels. Russian dealers sold Mazda B-Series with two airbags, power accessories, glasses and mirrors, alloy wheels, power steering and audio preparation. In addition, our car was sold in the most expensive version, with a double cab and wheel arch extensions. No matter how simple and maintainable the Mazda B-Series is, spending on its maintenance will still be required. Under the hood of the car was a four-cylinder turbo diesel with a volume of 2.5 liters and a power of 109 horsepower. The engine is very unpretentious and reliable. He willingly digests domestic diesel fuel, and the electronic heating of the fuel filter guarantees reliable operation in our conditions. Initially, the pickup truck had a high-pressure fuel pump, TNVD, which is distinguished by omnivorousness and endurance. And in 2005, he acquired an electronic control unit. The design is obviously more complex and capricious than the previous one, but, as the servicemen assure, there are not so many complaints about its work so far. For trouble-free operation, for preventive purposes, the masters recommend changing the oil after 5,000 to 7,000 kilometers, instead of the scheduled 10,000 kilometers, as well as letting the engine spin at idle after intense driving modes or rally raids. Better yet, install a turbo timer that turns off the engine only after the turbine has cooled down. Mazda B-Series transmission will last a long time if regular maintenance is carried out. To do this, every 10,000 kilometers, you should change the oil in the manual gearbox and transfer case, axles, and gearboxes. And also, as necessary, it is recommended to update the operating fluids. After overcoming the Ford, it is mandatory to change the oil in the transmission units and mechanisms. The suspension also requires intervention from time to time, but they are not so expensive. Engine. The turbo diesel with three valves per cylinder and an intercooler, 
installed on the Mazda B-Series until 2005, is very reliable and loyal to the quality of diesel fuel. Its more powerful version, which began to be put on a pickup truck six years ago, is more picky in terms of nutrition. In this case, the recommendation of mechanics to install an additional collapsible fuel filter is very useful, which really saves the high-pressure fuel pump from the ingress of solid particles, sulfur, and mechanical impurities. Suspension. In severe operating conditions, you will often change the lower ball joints and hub bearings. The rear springs begin to creak from the ingress of sand and dirt between them. The installation of plastic gaskets helps. Transmission. Very reliable due to its simplicity. In order for it to last for a long time, at each MOT, the universal joint and steering crosses should be injected, as well as all points that require lubrication. Monitor the condition of the anthers and CB joints, and this will save you from premature replacement of the grenade body. On older copies, there are chip paint on the hood, front fenders, and even rust. Paint work with streaks or uneven layers. In frosts, the doors do not open completely, the elements of the side mirrors burst.